Now let's take a look at the solo, which comes from the E minor pentatonic scale. First phrase goes like this. So from the ninth fret of the G string, we're gonna do a pre-bend of a step and a half. So we bend, then strike the note and release, pulling off to the seventh fret. Back to nine, pull off nine to seven, nine to seven again, slide down to seven D, five seven on the D string twice, five seven on the A, followed by another hit on the seventh fret. Last three notes, that's 5D, 7A, and once again, 7A. Here's that phrase once again. And now here's the next phrase. So starting off on the D string, hammer on five to seven, slide seven to nine, hammer on seven to nine on the G, followed by another hit on the ninth fret. Hammer on seven to nine. Now to the B string, eight to 10. From the 10th fret, we'll bend up a whole step, then strike the note, releasing, pulling off to the eighth fret. Repeat that, followed by 10 on the B string, eight, Two hits on the ninth fret of the G. And now to end this phrase, hammer on seven to nine on the G string, and two more hits on the ninth fret. So here's that phrase once again. Now we're gonna shift positions, slide into 12th position, and here's the next phrase. So we'll do a whole step bend from the 14th fret of the G string, followed by 12B, 12 on the high E. Now we're gonna bend a whole step from the 15th fret of the B string, Release slightly, and then bend again, releasing, followed by 15-12 on the B string. Now 15 on the high E string, we'll bend up a whole step. We'll do that twice. And then we'll do it one more time. This time we'll release the bend, pulling off to the 12th fret. Next three notes, 15, pull off to 12 on the high E, followed by 15 B. Repeat that. Next three notes, 15 pull off to 12 on the B string, followed by 14 on the G. So when we get to 14 on the G, we're gonna do a bend, followed by 12 on the B, 12 on the high E. Now we're gonna pull off 15, 12 on the B, followed by 14 G. Pull off 14, 12 on the G, followed by 14 on the D string. Back to the G string, 12 to 14. Now bend up a whole step, this will be a pre-bend, a whole step from 14 on the G, strike that note, release, and then 12 on the G. Okay, that's a lot of notes, a lot of numbers. Here's the phrase once again. Now here's the next phrase, this one will be a little shorter. Whole step bend from 14 on the G, hammer on and pull off 12, 14 on the G, followed by 14 D, 12 G, 14 D, pull off 14, 12 on the D, followed by 14 A, 12 on the D. And now here's the last phrase of the solo. Okay, 
Okay, shifting positions, but still more work from the E minor pentatonic scale. 12 to 10 on the A string. Pull off 12 to 10, this time followed up with 12 on the low E string. So we've just done this. Slide 12 to 14 on the A, 12 on the D. Hammer on 12 to 14 on the D, followed by 12G back to 14D. Back to 12 on the D. And the last three notes, which go to accent with the chords, will be 14, 12, 14 on the D string. All right, now let's put this entire solo together. So we're gonna be shifting positions a little bit. And there you have all the parts for Paranoid.